Uh, the four of us, we, we, uh, we're big footy fans. We come from different nationalities. and uh, we, uh, we decided that we wanted to start a supporter group for the Whitecaps that were different from other supporter groups that had already uh, established themselves. More like along the lines of like an English supporter group, uh, more European, like uh, being more of like a casual kind of like style. A little bit more of like a punk rock kind of skateboarding style supporter group. Well, definitely in Vancouver, you'll see us dressed in black. We were the first group to do it and uh, proudly still do it. Yeah, and I think every supporter group is different, but RCB is like a family that we come together and it, it, we just get together and have fun. That's, we we that's like to big. laugh. And make notice. jokes, obviously. Oh, it's, it's definitely growing. When we started, we were only like half a dozen, and now we're over like a hundred in our section. Up Hamilton to Robson, and then down to the stadium. Perfect. If you have smoke, please wait until we turn on to Robson before you use your smoke. Woo! Uh, my name is Juice Percy, and I, I'm an assistant director in the film and television industry. Um, Rain City Brigade for me, it seems like to me we're a band of outcasts that all just seem to have come together uh, to support each other and support our team and support our club. Uh, we all love the game and uh, I feel like we didn't necessarily fit in with other the clubs that were around and, and we've all found each other uh, as, a, as a united group of outcasts. Uh, my name is Corey Ferreira and I am the owner of Kingfisher Plumbing and Heating. They're more than just a supporters group, they're a family to me. Uh, I've been with the group since 2012 almost, and uh, they have your back. So it's one of those things where, you know, you got a family outside your family. And that's what I like about it. the supporter group in Vancouver are really like aligned like in the sense that we all support like the same cause we don't have like any like big differential about um, religion or who we cheer for but uh, all in all we're there for like having fun and we'd like to support our team right? exactly yeah. well we all have a common goal I mean we're we're here to support the white caps and uh, that's that's what we're here for we're here to support the team and everything that they do and everything that uh, they do along the way, whether it's good or bad. And I think I think we're all here for the same reason. We're all supporting the same team. We're all supporting the same game. We all want the same outcome. And I, I, I don't think I don't think there's any animosity. I think we're all here just to uh, just to have have our teams back and show them that we love them. And and when it really comes down to it, we are all one giant supporters club. We just have our own little quirks and tweaks. <laughs> The thing is, like we've, we've we've seen a lot of supporter groups around the world and stuff, and like, you know, there isn't any kind of mission necessarily. There's no like uh, like end goal. It's just basically to get like people that love the game and love the team and and want to support the team and have fun, but also want to like you know have good style, right? Yeah. For me, it's the family. It's it's unity. It's uh, everybody comes together. Uh, I can come here every game. Doesn't matter how many people show up. There's somebody here, and there's already somebody here to greet me. Uh, so it's it's family. And the biggest challenge of being a White Caps fan is that you got a lot of people who think that they're that that the MLS is not valid, and that uh, that it, like we can't call it football because Americans call it soccer. Uh, I, I think it's a sport we all love, and it's the best sporting experience in Vancouver. And I think that naysayers just need to come to a game, come hang out with us, 
for one night and they'll change their minds.